welcome to this brand new update we have two new updates this week so the first one is the dopamine we have a new version for the dopamine jailbreak for all of your supported devices from ios 15 and your ios 16 devices as you can see we are at the official github page for dopamine and if you check out the releases we have the version 2.4.6 version 2.4.6 mainly have some bug fixes but as pointed by a subscriber version 2.4.6 added a new ability to have the device display a boot logo for the dopamine jailbreak the default one and you can also select your own so that every time you use a space reboot it will be displayed on your device now as you can see i have this iphone 7 which is running ios 15 which is supported by the dopamine jailbreak i have already installed the dopamine jailbreak's latest version version 2.4.6 using troll store and if you open it you can see that i am already jailbroken so we will simply go to settings if i scroll down you can see we have the new option for the boot logo it will be enabled by default first of all we will see the default logo so if you simply open dopamine and then reboot user space you will now see this uh, new default logo for the dopamine jailbreak this only appears when you use a space reboot so it is not a boot logo it is a user space reboot logo and if you want to customize it you can again open the dopamine jailbreak app go to settings scroll down and you'll see this option which you can enable custom boot logo simply enable it and then hit select image then you can select a different image from your gallery or your photos app then hit keep current selection go back and then use space reboot and the image which you have selected will appear as a user space reboot logo i also recommend that please do update to the latest version of the dopamine jailbreak so that it fixes all your minor or major issues which you might have the second update we have is to the root hide bootstrap you can see that we have the new 2.0 version for the bootstrap the root hide bootstrap yes you will still see 1.4 in releases but we have the new commits for the version 2.0 beta as you can see right here if i open it you can see these changes we have faster app injection and we have some bug fixes in this new release that is version 2.0 beta also if you check out the official github page and scroll down you can see that it is a uh, fully featured bootstrap which works from ios 15.0 through ios 17.0 for all of your devices which support these versions but with version 2.0 it has turned into a semi jailbreak just like the nathan lr jailbreak so for example if you have issues using nathan lr on ios 17.0 and lore for all these supported versions you can try to use the new bootstrap version 2.0 instead of the nathan jailbreak and it will solve your issues as you can see if you check out the comments we have the changes that added springboard injection and launch daemon support so it will behave just as a semi jailbreak and you will be able to enjoy your tweaks now if you want to try it right now you can simply scroll down on the official github page for root hide you can point here and you will find the ipa file which you can then install it with troll store now as you can see i have installed the latest version for the bootstrap which is version 2.0 beta on my device using troll store as you can see this version right here it looks like this you will simply install it and then hit on install to install the bootstrap if you check out settings you can enable tweaks open ssh you can change the colors respring rebuild apps and so on 
you can also reinstall Cilio and Sebra from here if you want. I have already made a complete guide regarding root height bootstrap. You will find it in the description if you want to check it out. That's all for this update. If I have more to share, I will definitely do it with you. I will see you in a new video. Goodbye and take care of yourself.